Hey, it's Mahesh here for Beer Brand. And today, as we move into the summer, I'm going to talk to you about looking after your skin and tattoos. Here in the UK, it's starting to get a little bit sunny and we have had it up to 14 degrees, which is pretty hot for us. So instantly with my fair skin and covered in tattoos, I decided that maybe it might be worth doing a little bit of a video about looking after our skin and uh, how we look after our tattoos when we've got lots of tattoos. Now, the skin on your body is your largest organ. And it is a very good representation of how you are, whether you're feeling well, whether you're hydrated, whether you are looking after your body and your organs, because it will show up on your tattoos. If you are heavily tattooed, it will show up. They will feel raised if you're dehydrated and they will feel maybe sensitive. You, your skin will feel dry and, and itchy. You may have you know, areas on your skin, on your body that will have dry patches and they're all good indicators to the fact that you're maybe not quite yourself or you're not looking after just the external side of your skin. And you have to remember that skin has two sides, the outside and the inside. So it's about looking after the body to look after the skin. So let's think about how we can keep ourselves hydrated. So obviously we look at drinking plenty of water. As we start to move into the warmer weather and the warmer climate, you need to now be aware also of the fact that your tattoos and your skin will still feel the, the UV, regardless of whether there's clouds up there. So it's about being very mindful of the UV as opposed to just the direct sunlight. This is what is going to affect the skin and the tattoo, the way it looks, especially if you've got a fresh tattoo. You know, please, please, if you've got fresh tattoos, really, this is not the time of year to be exposing them too much to the sun. Wear and cover up on those new tattoos. Wear plenty of sunscreen. Now, as you can see, I'm very fair. I wear factor 50 and I'm not concerned about looking brown. That is not my goal. You will still look healthy. You will still have the benefits of sitting in the sun and the skin tone changing slightly with a factor 50. All you're doing is making sure that you're keeping your skin and your well-being and all the cells in your body looked after. And what you also need to remember is that when you're out and about in the sun, it isn't gonna affect you directly today, tomorrow. It might be 10 years down the line. It might be 15 years down the line when you start to have the side effects of not looking after yourself. The key things really for looking after your tattoos during the summertime is if you're gonna swim, make sure you reapply. Make sure you put good factor 50 or whatever factor you decide you need on your skin and make sure you reapply. Make sure you get every part of the skin that, that is gonna be exposed to the sun Make sure you stay well hydrated during the day. And then when you get home, shower that off and then moisturize. And then you're just making sure that you're hydrating from, like I said, both sides of the skin internally and externally. Because your tattoos will look amazing and stay looking amazing. I mean, my sleeves are over 10 years old now. And you know, I've looked after that. I mean, this, the red tattoo that I have in my, on my inner arm here is 12 years old now. And I've looked after it really well. And it stayed looking the color, pretty much the color as I had 12 years ago. So it's a, because I'm very vigilant about putting on the sunscreen. Also be considerate and mindful of the fact that if you've got a beard, make sure that you maybe put a little bit extra balm in that because that will dry and it will go brittle. If you're swimming, especially in salt water, that will dry your beard out. Really do try to rinse out the beard 
straight away if you've got chlorine or sea salt on your beard because that if you dry that salt into your skin if you dry that salt into your beard you are going to feel the negative effects of that that will give you the crispiest driest skin and beard that you've ever known the the chlorine as well obviously that that we all know that chlorine is not great for the beard but the sea salt as well so let's recap and just think about as we move into the summer as we move into the warmer time of the year how we're going to look after our skin and how are we going to look after our tattoos so we're going to make sure we hydrate well from internally and hydrate well externally we're going to make sure we use moisturizers in the evenings we're going to make sure that we drink plenty of water and we're going to make sure that we cover every single part of our skin that's exposed to sun with sunscreen so there you go we've talked about looking after the beard a little bit we've talked about looking after our skin and we've talked about hydration okay lesson all done go out and enjoy yourself in the sun go out and be well and this has been Mahesh for the Beard Brand. Beard Brand is a premium men's grooming company with products not only for your beard, but also your hair and body. Do yourself a favor and head over to beardbrand.com and take care of yourself. Or you can stick around and watch a few more of our awesome videos.